And what's your name? Um, Stephen Donahue. Thank you, Stephen. I'm panicking. And what's your name, sir? Jonathan Donahue. And what are you about to do in your arts award? Stop motion or animation. Excellent. Is that a skill that you're about to share? Yes. Um, me and too. I said me too. This is us setting up a scene to animate. We are using the good Scooby Doo. Fascinating and lovely. Yeah. I'd say it's splendid and and wonderful. Putting the, the camera in place. I've put up the camera to manual. I'm getting the laptop to power on. I am opening the Dragonfly software. I was relaxing. I turn the lights on and testing a shot. Paul forgot to take the lens cap off. <laughs> this Dragon Frame controller takes photographs and controls the soft wire. Now we were doing a focus check thing. First we clicked the square button, then we turned the camera lens to see better and we test shot the picture. This is us setting up a scene to animate. Are you happy with the test shot, John? Yep, yep, very much indeed, thanks. Um, Are you happy with the test shot, Stephen? Uh, yes, thank you. Yeah? Now, we put the onion skin on. Finally, the onion skin is when the character moves on the second place the character's first place was see-through. We have started an painting. I did movements. And I did the photos. We tripped over those Lego characters on the floor. Oh dear, it's, it's trip over. So we use onion skin to see the characters see through and we put the gang back where they were and we carried on animating. This button is pressed play. This is the finished scene of the stop motion film. So we gone on export and clicked export movie and clicked export.
Is that everything finished? Yep. Yes, thank you. Fantastic. We're very happy indeed. And it looks swell. Jason, the incident in Berlin may make you reconsider, but I found it. It will be a long and treacherous journey reaching new heights. We will be venturing into the unknown where nobody has been before, but we won't be alone. There will be dictators, warlords and old enemies. But Jason, the final thing I have to ask you is, Are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay. 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 No. <laughs> I've come to ruin Aladdin's goodies. <laughs> Never. I'm still in this spaceship.
So, I have no idea what it does. What happens if you press that button? Yeah, we're going to find out, really, so... Yeah, you guys are Go for it. Oh, well, that was a complete rip-off. <laughs> you got... What? Connor, what's happening? Yeah, what's happening with your voice? What's happening with mine? This is so weird. I have no idea what's happening, guys. Um, well... Well, I mean, I have somebody's voice. You have somebody's I think voice. I've got one of you yours. have somebody's voice. You have somebody's voice. Yeah. What's going on? I'd like my voice back, please. Can you press the button? Yes, again? press one of them buttons. All right. And you join us here tonight at the Fly Cheese Arena to witness a bloody bandit take on Bobby Dobby Evil. That's right, well, it's, it's going to be one heck of a fight. And here comes the bloody bandit now. A bloody bandit should be on top form tonight. He's been training for weeks for this fight. Yeah, it should be a good one, but it won't get messy.
Hi, Roddy. What you doing, mate? Whoa! Hello, you two. I'm just reading about Asperger's Syndrome. Asperger's Syndrome? What's that? It's a special condition. It explains in this article. Oh, I. Interesting. What exactly makes a person with Asperger's, Rod? Well, things can be quite hard. Everyone is different. One thing is hypersensitivity. You can smell, touch, or... Or what? <laughs> Sound. What about some of the positives, Roddy? Yeah. Life isn't all tough, you know. Well, although appearing shy, people with Asperger's are very friendly. Of course, just like you. And they can be very passionate about things like facts and figures, or can have special talents like music or media. What's more, they can have very unique interests, like sports statistics, roller coasters, or even talking trains like us. Wow, Roddy, that's amazing. Even some well-known names have been said to have Asperger's. Like who? Isaac Newton, Jane Austen. It's even said that Albert Einstein's had Asperger's. Fab trivia there, Rob. Thanks. Even knowing such trivia is an aspect of Asperger's, you know. Wow. Thanks for telling us about Asperger's, Roddy. It's a pleasure, you two. You know, people with Asperger's may be different, but in the end, they are just like any ordinary nice person. Open communication. This planet is ours. We'll blast it to pieces and sell them. There are people down there. We won't let you hurt them. Then we'll blast you too. Computer, move us between the enemy ship and the planet. Warning, weapon system. Get you next time! We'll be waiting.
I must get everything ready for the charity festival later. Hey princess, I've heard about your animal charity. You're doing great work, here's a tanner. Thank you all so much for coming, we've raised so much money. I'm going to deliver the money to the animals. I'll shoot. Don't follow Siva. Stay away. Breaking news! The princess has been captured. Can someone save her, please? Thank you very much for saving me, good guy. Thankfully, they didn't get the money. I will go back to the castle now. Goodbye. Goodbye. See you soon.
Thank you. It's got to be any Wallace and Gromit, because um, I, I grew up watching Wallace and Gromit, and um, to see Wallace and Gromit as an adult now, you um, you see all the references and the little Easter eggs that um, Nick Park hid in um, in certain aspects of the animation. And um, this morning I was watching uh, A Grand Day Out, and um, there was... Um, as the 
rocket had been built Wallace was just coming downstairs after getting supplies and um, there was a a picture of a sheep on the back wall of the basement which is actually foreshadowing a close shave. What do you like about animation? Um, I've got to say water textures. It, it still boggles my mind how they do water textures. Um, even in stuff like um, Studio Ghibli and as I say this morning I was washing a grand day out and he, Wallace was making the tea and he just poured water from the kettle into the teacups. I was just like, how do they make water? <laughs> just, it amazes me. What was your first animated film? Ooh, my first first one that is a tricky question well as I say um, I grew up with um, Wallace and Gromit so the first one ever had to be a grand day out and um, yeah I heard that um, Nick Park didn't actually uh, he, uh, he didn't like how a grand day out turned out because it looked very basic and very ropey but considering how Wallace and Gromit have evolved and grown and changed through um, a close shave, the wrong trousers, um, curse of the wear rabbit, chicken run, everything. Um, the um, So yeah I've sort of grown up as the animation has evolved, really, but... Who is your favourite animator or, or favourite famous animator or animators? Nate Park. <laughs> That's just no question. <laughs> it's got to be your favourite animated character. Ooh, um. It's got to be Sean the Sheep, actually, because um, not only did he star in A Close Shave, he's also got his own series on uh, on CBeebies now, and um, he's got his own film as well, so yeah, that was enjoyable. What's got to be your funniest experience with animation? Um, yeah, I do have the the nickname of Cookie Monster now. Because um, every break I'm just like... Nom, 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 nom. I eat my body weight in biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's all the questions now. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's got to be any Wallace and Gromit. Because um, I, I grew up watching Wallace and Gromit and um, to see Wallace and Gromit as an adult now you see all the references and the little Easter eggs that um, Nick Park hid. Hey WWE fans, it's me, Matt Cork. I'm with um, uh, Jerry Long. It's going to be a 10 fight tonight. Hey Jerry? Yeah, the Undertaker winning streak is very much on the line tonight. Yes Jerry, it's going to be a psychic fight tonight. It could go either way. Yeah, let's go down to the inside and join the action. Let's do this. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it, Michael. I can't, can't believe it too, Jerry. Here comes the pin. 
Mà thấy không, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Ủa, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Ủa, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Ủa, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Ủa, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Ủa, cái gì nó dễ thì kích thác là tìm kèm Lock is on the floor, he's going for the pen. The Undertaker appears to be going for it, the Elm's gate. I think he's going to tap out, he's going to tap out. The Undertaker won the match. The Undertaker remains undefeated. His winning streak remains intact. That was an awesome match. Tune into the Raw tomorrow day to see all the highlights. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone.
this is Toria. Yo, Tori. Me and my brother have been invited to this great dance party. Oddly enough, dear brother, it's happening at our house right now. Remember to invite Frisk while I'm on the dance floor. Bye. You were saying, Sans? Uh, oh. Anyhow, we were wondering if you and Frisk would like to tag along. Now, who else should I contact for my devious plan? Hello? Who is this? <coughs> oh, what do you want? <coughs> Don't call me back! <coughs> Sleeper. That sounds quite exciting. Hold on, I will see if the child would like to go. Frisk! What was that? I hear anything out there. Probably just the wind. General Jimmy's here! Oh, you lazy elves! You need to get your act together for this important mission. We have received intelligence that an enemy spy has infiltrated London. You clans need to catch her! She goes by the name of Susie Spy. Catch her at all costs. Right, dismiss. I completely forgot. Here's the memo in full. Remember, it's top secret. Right, get to work. Hey, old Jimmy, quick, move! Oh cool, an ammunition store. Warning, explosives keep out. It will be fine. Well guys, let's load up. Check it out. Cool, revolver. Whoa, whoa, private generals only. 
Ooh, what's this? What do we have here? What's this fucking do? Jason, no! <laughs> Let's get out of here. Doors closing. Doors opening. Wrong bucket, that one. Doors closing. Doors opening. Jason, watch where you're pointing that gun. What have I done?
Knight Rider, a shadowy flight into a dangerous world of a man who don't exist. This is urgent. A criminal gang has broken into Flychee Studios, stealing various filming equipment. Oh, my. Okay. I'm counting on you. Don't you mean we are now way? Yes. But, oh well. Let's go. No lenses, no it's here. Quick, get in the car! Oh yeah, yeah. Activated. Oh yeah. Great, we've lost him. I need some help. What with, Michael? Mission. Okay. It's not even a party. Let's go. I'm not here. Why are we? Hello. Goodness me. What was that? Yes, no. Not at all. Big deal. Aye, aye. Three, me, two, the two, two, three, what? No. I don't take well to flying. Yeah, ah, book it. Initiate fly board. Alfred, I told you to pay our electricity bill. Alfred, the generator's damaged. I'm going to see what he's repairing. The power's been cut, sir. I'll investigate. Here's the generator. Pull the plug. Joker said it's around here somewhere. Here it is. Power's out. 
Surprise! I had my mind for your power, Batman. <laughs> Where am I? Nobody's coming, Batman. You're mine now. <laughs> I'll have you back behind bars soon, Joker. Robin, Batman's been taken by the Joker. Don't worry, Alfred. I'm on it. Find him. I said I'll handle it. Where's Joker taking Batman? You won't find him. Do you want to be sent to a straw? Okay, okay. He's in an old warehouse down the road. Thank you. Hey, what's the news? Boss had me robbing some banks. That ain't nothing. The Joker had us bringing the back to Get out of here. Anyways, I gotta go meet Skagnetti. Skagnetti? What a jerk. Who's this wise guy? This must be the place. Security's tight. I have to proceed carefully. Alfred, I think I found him. No doubt the trap for you. Looking for the big bad bat, little Robin? Well, he's already on the move. It's a trap! Well, that didn't go to plan, did it? There's always next time. There's a trick, Alfred. He's not there. I'm picking up his tracking signal now. He's in Arkham Asylum somewhere. Got it. The boss wants this place kept secure. Who's this guy? It's Robin! Get him! Seems Robin's looking for you, Batman. My boys will take care of him. You won't get away with this, Joker. We'll see, Batman. We'll see. Got the Batman. Nobody's gonna find him. What's this guy doing here? I have you now, Robin. <laughs> bye bye, Birdie. B-Man, Robin. The coin thinks you're not going to get out of this. Uh, you'll never find him. I found him. You're close now. Alfred, the signal's coming through a sealed room. I'm going to figure out how to get in. I can get in through this window. I'm here, Batman. What kept you? Turn around. Time to end this Joker. Really? It's time for the main event. <laughs> Why is he laughing? We just pushed him. <laughs> Let's end it here. This time I'm gonna put you down. How about some laughing gas? <laughs> oh no, now Robin's being caught too. Best get Nightwing to get them out.
Nightwing, Batman and Robin are being held hostage in the Arkham Asylum by the Joker. Am I it, Alfred? I thought I just heard something. It's coming from over there. It's Nightwing! Get him! Come on, guys. Give me a real fight. Hmm. This wire must be a clue. Maybe it was what Joker tied Batman up with. This means I'm on the right track. Found him, Alfred. I'll give this door a quick boot. Thanks for coming, Nightwing. I'm out of here, boys. Those drumming skills came in handy. <laughs> I'm Batman. I wonder what this button does. <laughs> How dare you knock over my giant head? You think you got me trapped? You think you got me back? We better get the goons before they escape again. Get them in the line. I'll tie them up. Come here, Joker. I'll have you back behind bar soon. Okay, Batman, I'll come quietly. Gordon, I need you to send a car for Joker's men. Very well, sir. Damn it. Into the van, Joker. You think this is over, Batman? When I get out of here, Gotham will be mine. Oh shit, Joker. Thanks, Batman. Joker's not going anywhere anytime soon. No problem, officer. Let's go home, boys. Well, Alfred, the generator's back online. I know, sir. The lights are back on. I'm glad that's over with. We finally got the Joker behind bars. Surprise!
Welcome to Yolksville, mysterious spider city where all nourish folk can come in and join our world. A life where human, magi, magical, and mundane, all in size and form, can join to live in our land and join our world. Our right is our freedom, and with us, truly believing in knoweth, we are truly believing the light. It all began when a young boy called Edgar, who was enjoying the beautiful view of Yorksfield on a sunny day. What an awesome day. Boy, it's windy. I'm losing control. Windy, windy, too much wind. Get it off me, get it off me. Oh, what is this? After I fell, I stumbled into an interesting area. A hidden cave. The hole is way too high for me to climb up. So I went inside the cave to see if there's a way out or something to get me out. However... Grabbed the sword from the end. I sensed the sword's power, but there's no blade. Fine sword, bah. After some frustrating shaking, the sword turned out to be a wand, and then it turned into a blade. Then I discovered that it's a wand. I headed back to the hole to see if it can get me out.
Amazing. I want to try that. Hey, wait up. Wait for me. Please, can you teach me that? What the? It's gone. The photo, it's gone.
I, Abby Strange. Hey, stop that! of today. Thanks very much. No, that's alright. I just needed some time to think about it. Oh good. What's your answer? Want to be my student? Oh yes, I'd love to be a student. Shall we? Yes, this. Gosh, what happened? Ah! Ah! Uh, hello. I'm <laughs> 
Overwhelming. Challenging. Naughty. Unemployable. Only boys get autism. Don't like change. Stop! Is this really how we view autism? Let's change the scene. Let's view autism through my eyes. I'm Emily Davidson. I'm going to explore the challenges and stigma that is attached to autism. I'm here to change perceptions and show that not every autistic person should be treated the same. We're all unique and I'm going to show you that. Stereotypes suggest that autistic people hate being in busy loud places. But here I am in a busy loud cafe. Autism is a lifelong developmental disability which affects one in a hundred people in the UK. It affects the way the person communicates and how they experience the world around them. When being diagnosed with autism, it becomes clear that it's a very tick box exercise when autism is such a wide spectrum. People think accessibility is just ramps and disabled toilets but it's a lot more. Accessibility can sometimes be misleading. It's not just about the building layout, it's actually about the work environment. If you put disability on your CV, most people assume the negatives and not the positives. But statistics don't have to be like this. Autism shouldn't stop you from doing what you want to do. And this year, I set up my own YouTube channel. I use this to share my views and have fun. I also want to be an actress and earlier this year I took part in a performance in London. Autism is still a challenge but I'm tackling them head on. Educate, don't discriminate because there are things that we couldn't do because of the barriers we face and all we want to do is have the drive and motivation to learn. a case for you two. What case is it, sir? I want you to catch Weaselton. He robbed the bank last night. Okay, sir. Judy, let's go. Weaselton, you are under arrest for robbing the bank. You work now, Weaselton. Okay, you got me. Mission accomplished, sir. And chaps, excellent job.
Ben şimdi izliyorum. Geçen mi bağlayacağız? We are going on the case of the haunted mansion because it's full of monsters and they scare people and children and they are frightened and run away. Maybe the mansion has treasure and it belongs to a good person. All right then, Fred. But we can't go to that mansion and we hate monsters. Yeah. Don't be scared, guys. It's only a mystery. Jinkies! My! Alright gang, let's split up. Now let's go find that treasure.
go. The treasure is nearly somewhere. It's a mummy's sarcophagus. Ooh. Wow. No, guys. We're looking for clues, remember? Ah yes, we found the treasure. I wonder what might be fun. Goodness gracious, just look at all this. Diamonds, gold, rubies, sapphires, emeralds, amethysts, tourmalines, and silver. Wow, it's very beautiful and fascinating. Like jumping jelly beans, get a load of these. Ooh, pretty. Well, gang? We finished the mystery. We defeated the villains. We knew these villains were hiding this treasure. We finished the clue. Scooby Dooby Doo. <laughs> Goodbye. Right, there's no one around. Hands up, give us your money. <laughs> Hurry up! Stop me, never all. Oh no, Batman! Oh, drag. so far when you're lost in the mountains, was he left lonely and lost?
Where shall I go next? Malfoy, meet me at Tonga to Woods at noon tomorrow. Don't let anyone know about meeting. I'll be waiting. The boy will do it, my lord. Welcome, Draco. We need your help. Anything, my lord. The Elder Wand. We need it. Who has it? Dumbledore. We need it to take over the world. You must kill Dumbledore. Be me the want. I'm not that strong enough. I'm not that strong enough. I will help you. Snape, you must help Draco. Yes, my lord. As we speak, Dumbledore is on his way to the tower. If we work together, we can defeat him and take the wand. Yes, Professor, but how? We need to make sure that Dumbledore is alone, and together we can defeat him. Yes, Professor, as you wish. And then we will deal with Harry Potter. You need to be very careful, Harry. These are dangerous times, especially for you. Always keep your wits about you. You never know who. Harry, you better hide. Oh, good afternoon, Draco. Don't move. Draco, no! You don't have to do this. Let me help you. I don't need your help. You don't understand. I've got to kill you. It's the only way. I once knew a boy, Draco. A young boy who made all the wrong choices. There is another way. Let me help you. I've got to kill you. I'm sorry. Snape, no, please!
we have the one. Let's get out of here. Don't think I made a mistake. Take it! No! Get away from him. Leave him alone. What have I done? <laughs> I've been trained to go. I've been trained to go. <laughs> Alfred, you. He trusted you. I had no choice but to kill him. For I am the Half Blood Prince. And the Dark Lord needs the old. Voldemort? You're working for Voldemort? <laughs> it's too late for you, Potter. Your time is up. <laughs> Hermione. We have the one master. Let's get out of here. Explain everything. Ah! 